Hi everybody, it's Diane. Well, we're <clears throat> almost um, to New Year's Eve and New Year's, the new year being 2016, of course. So I did make a new wallpaper for my iPad, celebrating monsters and the year 2016. Um, I did, um, if you are a avid watcher of my videos, you've seen me reach the magic number several times where I've gone below and then reached it again. And uh, recently with the addition of Tribal Island, the week that Tribal Island was introduced, I dropped millions of coins trying to feed, level up my tribal monster and dropped below the magic number. And uh, I've reached it again. So I'm so excited to <laughs> get my magic number back. but. <clears throat> oh, let me, oops, there we go. There it is. So we'll see if my game will open here. Uh, I, also, if you're a watcher of my, a viewer of mine, you'll um, know that my game rarely opens right away. I had it open about an hour ago, so I thought maybe it would possibly stay open, but it's not. So anyway, the magic number is the 1,999,999,999 coins. Once you reach that number in your game, it stops uh, showing you the accumulation of coins. Your coins keep accumulating. You just don't know what it is. They're, the, the total is, sur is saved in uh, Big Blue Bubble's server. Um, but all you know is unless, until you spend enough coins to drop you below that number, you have at least 2 billion coins and then some. <clears throat> because uh, now when I collect in my game, it will not uh, show an increase in coins. Although they are increasing. I guarantee you that they are there. We just don't see it. Once my game opens, oops. Once my game opens, we'll go collect a few coins, which I've already done this morning, sorry, but <clears throat> we'll do something here. <clears throat> oh, we had a rare reprise all weekend uh, long, uh, through Christmas and through the weekend, which ended yesterday. Um, and uh, I was fortunate enough to breed um, seven four element rares yesterday just a half hour before the reprise ended. <clears throat> and that was in two of my games, my Let's Play game and my main game. <clears throat> and I was uh, very lucky. <clears throat> Excuse me, my cold. Um, very lucky all weekend, or throughout the reprise, I bred a lot of rare monsters in all four of my uh, active my Sea Monsters games. I do have one that's a fifth one that's played just every once in a while. <laughs> Twitter. Okay, now maybe we'll open here. This is my uh, main tribe. This is tribe uh, Diane. And uh, it's a full tribe. I do not have spaces for anybody this week. But stay tuned. On Mondays is when I uh, remove and add new members. Um, if I have members who didn't feed throughout the week are removed, then um, if they did not feed at all, then they're removed before uh, Sunday, before the rewards are even distributed. If they have fed, but they haven't fed up to level 10, um, if they're just a low level um, feeding, then I will uh, usually swap them out for somebody else who wants to feed um, more. And I do that Monday mornings. So, um, But right now, it, we are a full tribe and waiting for um, some of the players to get in and feed their they're monsters. Of course, we're early in the game. Okay, so I have some coins to collect here. My Twitter friends are chatting with me here. I'm just going to collect some coins here. And then you'll notice that my totals 
don't change the one billion and that's because of that magic number um, the coins are accumulating be assured the coins are accumulating it's just kind of a fun little thing that happens in our game that doesn't uh, mean a lot I have a rare to place and I have to figure out room to place him <laughs> So I'll go back and do that later. But uh, like I said, I was really lucky um, in breeding. <clears throat> I have the ones that I bred yesterday are still breeding. They haven't even, because of course they're 24 hours breeding and 24 hours hatching. So the ones that I bred yesterday, well, maybe this is one of them. No, nope. yesterday I started breeding at 10.30. What time is it? Um, 10.15. So this would be one of them here. This would be one that I, yep, see 45 minutes from now. So just about 10 minutes to 11, just 10 minutes before the reprise ended, I bred this guy here. So once he's done breeding, then he'll go into the hatching structure. So yeah, I've got a lot of stuff going on here. So super exciting. Let me see what this one is. 24. That's just a normal um, riff there. Anyway, so I'm just collecting a few coins, but mainly I was just making this uh, just to show you the magic number. And for those of you that are new to the game, you've not heard me mention the magic number. And here I have another rare ready to place, but of course I don't have room, so I've got to figure out what I'm doing with these rares. <laughs> ah, preparing for the next rare Wubbux. So I, I collect my coins um, two, three, four times a day. My shards I try and collect once every five to six hours so I can um, get them when they've reached their, or almost re reached their max. I, I'd rather collect them before they reach their max. When you get the coin uh, bubble that pops up above a monster's head, um, well, let's see, let's like uh, quibble. Oops, 3,375 coins we just collected. Let's look at the information and... Um, so he did reach his max. But the coin bubble pops up when they've reached 75% of their max and it continues to increase uh, until it reaches max. So when this po bubble pops up and if you collect it and you're going, hey, that's not how much I'm supposed to get. That's just because it, it, um, it, it's, it pops up above their head at 75%. Um, we can try that with Mammoth. Let's look. Mammoth reaches his max fairly quickly. We'll just collect them all right here. Let's look at Mammoth. Uh, rare Mammoth's a little bit higher than normal Mammoth. Mammoth stats. Okay, so his max is 2,880. And he does that at 90 coins a minute. So 30 plus minutes he reaches his max. So, no, we're not going to wait 30 minutes to show you uh, his max. <laughs> no, let's take a look here. Um, I doubt I'm looking for Noggin. Here's Noggin. Okay, so Noggin's reached their max. Here his t I just collected 216 coins from Noggin. Oops, get out of my way. Get out of my way, Noggin. There, Noggin. Um, information. Here's Noggin. And here's stats. Noggin's max is 216 coins. Okay, so let's watch for him. And that's like in three minutes he'll have reached his max. Because he's getting 72 coins every minute. And so in three minutes he will... Well, in less than three minutes, he's going to reach his max. So we can watch him. Um, <clears throat> when that coin bubble pops up above his head, it will be 
less than the max because it's going to have popped up when it's only reached 75% of his max, maximum amount of coins. That's why Noggin Armies are really a great way to boost your income when you're a brand new player. Noggin Army, Noggins take, what, 20 seconds to breed a Noggin and then you place them. Um, get the XP for placing him. In just a minute, he's going to reach his 75% of his max or close to his max in just a minute or two. And uh, then you can collect his coins and just do it over and over again. You could sell them and buy more, sell them and buy more. You still get your XP and you get fast coins if you do like a Noggin Army. So. <clears throat> That's why I promote Noggin Armies in the beginning of a brand new game. Quick way to build up your coins. <laughs> I'm not sure. They might be talking about the snow on Twitter. All the snow we had. <clears throat> Those that were jealous that they didn't get snow or some of them got brief amount of snow. Um, Goliath hit us pretty good, but not as bad as some places. Okay, so there's his little coin bubble. It popped up. And when I collect 169 coins, if I had waited just a few more seconds, it would have been higher than that. And then eventually in three minutes, it would have reached his uh, max, which is 216. So at 169 coins, it popped open because that was 75% of his max. <coughs> so that's that's just explaining why sometimes when you collect, the total is not what it shows as what his max should be. is because you're collecting it before it reached max, which is awesome. I love when I can collect my coins before they've reached their max, which means they're forever earning for me. If I let them reach their max, they stop earning until I collect it. And then they start over earning again. So, um, all right. Well, that's just a little tip about uh, Max Coins. And I will talk to you guys soon. Have a great day. And I hope you uh, are staying safe in this storm that is continuing across the country. Um, but here it's over. It's just deep, deep piles of snow all over the place. But we're all safe and sound here. I will talk to you guys soon. Have a really great day. Bye now.